Hey, what's up? Nah, but uh, I've been playing it. But the game well, I was on it. was uh, Battlefront, man. It's way better. Like, nah, I'm not worried about it. The, it's the. Sh it can be. It's the shit. Well, it can be the shit. It's not gonna be in this house. <laughs> because anything that would distract me from Jim's award this week can kiss my arse. Well, right now. Well, I'm the. Uh, right now, I'm playing Wolfenstein, so. Yeah, yeah, I saw another like killing Nazis. Okay, Especially the big ass machine gun that they I, created. I don't need the screaming. Mm-hmm. Well, it's, it's just worse. Leaves, it's either screaming to the Nazis I kill, huh? Yeah, yeah. I, I was gonna ask you if you'd looked at the leaderboard lately. Oh no, why? You up there? Uh yeah, I'm in the top ten right now. Ooh, cookies. And I'm loving every minute of it. Mmm. Well, victory is nice. So. I'm trying to just stay there because everybody behind me wants to earn like 40,000 souls today, apparently. I mean, uh, PvP points, apparently. Ah, oh, hell, I hate these things. What? The first, the first place guy has doubled my PvP points. Oh. Uh... And pretty much it's all one guild doing this. I mean, their their entire life is dedicated to this. That is not gonna happen to with me to any game. Just saying. Even. Oh come so. on. But what? You I know mean, you wanna. My dedication to one game. What's wrong with them? I uh, know. Uh, one game is all I'm dedicated to. I mean, for the most part. I know, but you have to work. Game, you have an excuse. This. You're, you're, you're working though, that's that's different. Yeah, I guess. But, I'm, ooh, I, mean, that's ooh, I just took not place. I took not place. Ah, this is, this is BS right now. I took not place. I took not place. Uh, 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 uh. Um, I'm, I'm only, ooh, I am only like 13 hundred away from taking eighth place. By the way, what's up now, Hawk? Is he here? Yeah, he man. is. He's, oh, he's, what's he's up, dude? Top what's up, How dude? You bet? No, I'm fine. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Sean. <laughs> what? I wish you were good enough to be doing this. You would so enjoy it. Why? Well, what's Sean doing? Uh, he's trying to uh get better at the game oh. on PlayStation. Oh. He's really he's really I like good at the game. Correct, you just like get better at the game on PlayStation. Uh. <laughs> wow. Well, I mean, I, you <laughs> sent me pics of your other account, and it's good enough to do this crap. That's because it's already done. <laughs> he said that's because it's already. Done. Wait, tell us what, what do you mean? It's, it's what do you mean? It's already done. It's already won. Won what? Rank one. <laughs> oh, you you already been up there? It's already there right now. <laughs> How? <laughs> wait, you tell, you're telling I'm me just you not, just, I'm just wait, not cruel. Wait, wait, <laughs> is somebody telling me they just stole Spider Thunder? And That's yeah, he, awesome. he tries to compete. He, he, he tries oh. to compete with my. Uh, he, he tries to compete with my uh, like awesomeness. phone slash iPad account. I thought you were gonna say. I thought you were about to say your awesomeness, but yeah. Well, he's got the cheating power of his guild on there. Cheating power of his guild. <laughs> hey. Mhm. Mm sometimes it takes. Sometimes you down to get ahead and to get a win. Sometimes. Yeah, but. The stronger the guild, I mean, if if the majority of the guild is the same level as you, you're more powerful. 
I mean, I, I, I mean, I'm just now starting to drive towards the PvP aspect of the game. I've just gotten back into the competitive scene of gaming. That's one of the reasons I have been, uh, you know, kind of missed it. I know? just wish that I just wish that every team that fights me wouldn't crack it. Cracking map, cracking and map on every defense team for about for about for about. For about for about 20 matches, then it switches over to famine, Scion, hey, or Rep. Yeah, it's a decent defense team. Huh? It's a decent defense team. Uh huh. The only thing that's crap about it is while I'm sitting there trying to charge my guy, Scion just smacks oh, crap. me and kills all my mana. Murder his ass. Ah, T, I'm sorry. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> I could nearly follow up the rest of the song. <laughs> if I swear, if I had to do the rest of that BS a minute ago. Okay, thank God. <coughs> You're sitting there chugging your little energy drink. <laughs> yeah, I've done that before. Yeah, it's only it's only ten after midnight, so <laughs> You'll only have to be going to work here in a little bit. Oh, you don't work tomorrow? Oh sweet, that means you can stay up all night playing and then go to sleep about nine o'clock this morning and sleep six hours. Or not six hours, uh four hours. Okay. And then go to work. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh I know. I feel the same way. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I missed you and that hot. I miss those. I miss those all night gaming runs I used to do. I really do. I miss them. Sean's a bastard. He still does them. <laughs> I sometimes. Well, I don't do all nights, but if I'm off the next day, I will. You're off every day. In the head. Kind of, yeah. I am when I'm gaming, but yeah, kind of psycho, but no, mm -hmm. no regrets to that. And here comes the fun. I'd be lying if I said there wasn't off in the head, though. You'll ask my friends, they'll tell you the same thing. That's because I'm always taking their ass, I know. Though. I'm one of them, that's why I say you're off in the head. Ooh. Oh, shit. Not you. Not you just showed up out of nowhere, <laughs> these little creeps. But they aren't creepy enough, mm. they just... Mm. Yeah, bitch. Go, to, go right. back to sleep. Not you. I'm talking to a Nazi. Digital Nazis, real Nazis. I don't care what it is. They deserve to die. That's the one decent aspect of Call of Duty, baby. Kill the Nazis. I mean, come on. In the best way possible. I mean, come on. I get a lot of pleasure out of doing that. I don't know why. Well, something tells me. Something tells me I'll be able to stay in the top 100, but I'm not going to stay in the top 10. I can already tell you that. I can't play that much. Hey. Yeah, I mean, you, you literally have to be getting paid to play in order to play that much. I, guess I, I would love that. 
That's what she said. Hey, there's a lady present. Who knows? I don't know, maybe they find Kelly Nazi sexy, I don't know. Come on, you know you want to come closer. Bitch, get out of here. What the? Alright. I hate it when a computer goes on those rants, you know, where they're like, I'm gonna win and you're good, you do about it. <laughs> That's like Donald Trump, that was like a Republican. That's right, this, this year. Why are you complaining about Trump? I don't know. The jokes are funny. I'm sorry. No, they're not. They're yeah. Democratic bullcrap because Democrats want to rule the world and they get passed because he's changing everything. That they've, they've been working years to get in. Uh, in. I'm not Republican. I'm not Democrat, but I'm for anybody but Democrat. And, and since independent really don't win, I went Republican. And the way I see it is if you didn't actually cast a vote, you can't complain about it. That last statement I agree with. Definitely. I don't like Democrats either, but I do like funny jokes. I just don't like the, uh, the way they try to control the yeah. office, no, the way they try to control the office is by allowing uh, pretty pr easy, easy immigration. You know, they lax our immigration laws yeah. because they know the people. That, they know the people that are moving here are used to dictatorships, so they're used to big government control and everything. And uh, by doing that, they'll always gain those people's votes, and uh, they use that to control the office. I mean, I admit Trump's a little crazy, but um, he 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 was the lesser of two evils. That is true. <laughs> well, Hello. He's not a politician, so therefore, you know, he's not going to talk like a politician. I just feel like it would be Trump if he didn't, you know, think before he talked. <laughs> you know, he's always been like that, even before he was president. Mm-hmm. That's just him. Yep. Yes, he did. Eh. Yep, crazy world. It's oh, crazy come on, how many... World. Okay, this is BS. No, this is BS. I sat there, look, no, I had my whole team, I had my whole team. I made four moves doing extra turns oh. trying to kill somebody, casted two Krakens that you didn't devour anybody or kill anybody, and then justice casts itself, makes the whole board blue, and charging, Val, uh, you know, charging up Mab, and then uh, enough stuff cascaded to charge Valkyrie. Uh, Mab cast with a whole bunch of blue out there, extra turn. Ma uh, Valkyrie cast, whole bunch of blue, recharging Justice and Mab. Mab cast, extra turn. Justice cast, uh, extra turn. Mab cast game. Amen. Adi <laughs> 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 Akbar. <laughs> <laughs> he said, "Oh dear." <laughs> like, oh, oh well, shit happens. <laughs> well, you gotta remember, he's from England. They've they've had several bad attacks. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I forgot. Well, I don't know what it is, but London has a habit of getting bombed. But just saying. <laughs> He's got the best attitude ever. Now, here's what here's what the United States needs to do. 
they need to build a wall around the entire country that is about 20 foot high, surrounded in razor wire, and uh, and with anti-aircraft guns mounted on them, and uh, you know, so uh, so you and, and anti-aircraft missiles. So you know you can you can't get over that rim wall unless they want you to come over it. And then, in order to enter the U.S., you have to fill out a form and pay five thousand dollars and wait six to eight weeks to see if it goes through. Problem is, uh, what if it ends up? What, see, the last person to try to build a wall over entire country was also the leader, the start beginner, beginning of like World War Two. So it was just like, no, uh, that was just trying to keep out crap. I know. Well, it didn't work. They, it was <laughs> racism led, though. Yeah. Good old age. Well, that's the heck with race lead, racism. The only people I have trouble with, I don't care what color you are, if you're an ass to me, I'm an ass to you. Yep. <laughs> I don't need. I do. I do too. You think it's like. I feel like it's like moves people backwards it's like pre it's like counterproductive if nothing else well I mean I haven't I haven't seen a single person that's over the age of 50 who likes anybody that's a different color that's a problem though here in the south anyway I should say St. Louis ain't, ain't uh, haven really easy it looks like I mean it, this morning me. just this morning just this morning I heard a guy say GD N word you will hide in the torpedo. Force will slip it back into main supply. And you will wake up on a U-boat for breakfast time. Once we have a U-boat, we take it to set secret safe keep, yeah? Mm. Sailors, get in the way. Bang bang all the pup. Come on, man. I'll fuck the pig, you just hold the ears. Okay, career Johnny. Get in the <laughs> <way>. <laughs> 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 Patch this thing into the communication room and raise the antenna buoy. We need radio contact. Yeah. Well, you shouldn't use that particular word because that one is like meaning hate. That one's hate. That, that one's that one's derived in hate. Just call her something. Um, you know, I mean, you know, since black folk, you know, they they love their fried chicken, and, they, and some of these are stereotypes for a lot of them, but you know. The majority, they love Kool-Aid, they love fried chicken, they love watermelon. <laughs> now, 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 be careful. I want to remind everybody that uh, the, there's a person in here married to a black man, and uh, I love her to death, and she's a guildmate, and I don't want to offend her in any way. I'm not either. I mean, a lot of people around here where I'm at, or a lot of a lot of the elderly folk around here, they're extremely racist. They do. I mean, I, I've heard I've heard these older guys up at the store that talk at the store in the morning say, you know, uh, talking about gay people, they need to go into their houses and drag them out and shoot them in the street. Just because it's an abomination to have sex with another man in their eyes, and 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 the, and they use it as it's biblically written.
sunblock. <laughs> Well, I mean, uh, one of the guys, I'm not going to mention who he is because none of you would know him anyway, but uh, I got one elderly guy up here. Uh, see, the store the store is owned by Indians, and he calls them sand niggers. She just said her husband was a skunk. She just said her husband was a skunk. <laughs> He's milk chocolate. He's creamed. He's coffee with creamer. I love people. I, I love people. I really do. I never. I well, see my one of my biggest problems. One of my biggest problems around guys. I mean, not guys, girls. My whole life has been women always take everything I say as offensive when it's not. I mean, the things I say most of the time, I'm thinking one thing, but everybody else thinks the other. That's because I've been snapped at so many times throughout my life i've i've grown accustomed to thinking before i speak mhm mm Well, the thing that makes you a better person is not taking offense to anything anybody calls you because guess what? It's their opinion. They're entitled to it. Get over it. It's not going it's not going to hurt you. Mm-hmm. Well, see, uh, <laughs> I tell you what's funny. Is if you're if you're gay and your best friend is a girl, and uh, you didn't know it, but you're both dating the same guy, that would be hilarious. Yeah. You just left. No, no, no. You. Uh, uh, I'm actually talking about the plot from. Um, uh, it's 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 the season three of the uh, Shit Creek on Netflix. Um, oh well, I mean, it's pretty funny. I mean, the dude is. I mean, what's that new What's that new term they've added to the LGBT crap? I I can't think of the 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 new term. What, what's that What's that one? Um. There's this new term people use that uh, though the person will make love to anything as long as you know it's <laughs> I mean literally a man woman animal it don't matter I mean pansexual pansexual that's it yeah this the guy the guy yeah the guy in the show is pansexual and his best friend is a girl and uh, he and this dude they got up together at, you know they were you know they just got done doing their business and. Uh, 
the 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 guy leaves the room and then about an hour later he goes downstairs and he's he's with her he's with her and so, <laughs> Yeah. Well, when I first heard about it, I was like, "What the hell is a pansexual?" I I'm genderless. I'm genderless. Oh. Oh, you behave. Quit talking to me like that. Not if I can have my way about it. Yeah, and the thing you're looking for, by the way, is called a gender queer. Gender queer? Yep. No, that that that, that is actually it. It's, uh, I'm back. I. Trans. Man, those guys are nuts. Opposites. Those guys are nuts. I don't care what he says. They give shit. Trump shit for not believing in climate change, and they don't believe in science, apparently. Gender free, uh, gender. Gender. Fuck gender you. The fuck control. that gender shit. There's two genders. There's been two oh, genders dude. since the fucking beginning dude. of time. That will not change. One of the changes mentality. Hey, what? you don't gotta yell. I'm just saying, you know. Man, people can hear you just fine. I know. I'm just saying. No, you were screaming. I'm sorry. Ow, fuck. <sighs> okay, I'm relaxed again. Yeah, mushrooms will do that. Uh, I just don't like confrontation. Uh, or anything yeah. confrontational. I really can't stand it. Your love so snubs. stressful. Your love my grocery store. Come on. Hi. They're like, this price ain't that price. This price ain't this. The kip shock. You know, you remember they what? forget that. Yeah, it's just like. I can, if I got paid for every time they complain about the price not being the sign and because the sign's fucked up, I'd be pretty damn rich. Oh, people complaining about prices because, uh, well, mm -hmm. I'll tell you, how would you, like to, how would you like to go into a convenience store where nothing has a price on it and when you take it up where they charge you what they want? Well, I, I wouldn't mind being able to do that. Cause it'd make it go faster. <laughs> I wouldn't care as much as I get paid and people leave. Well, you don't need to be working in a grocery store. <laughs> yeah, well. With an attitude like that, go off. I don't show the attitude. I mean, I'm in a manager's position, so I don't really matter for me now. But I don't show that attitude. It's just, you know. Yeah, but even that frame of mind, I mean, that that tells me, you know, right there, you've got that city slicker attitude, you know, where I just don't give a crap as long as I get mine. I mean, you know, people that's from the country, they're yeah. raised. You come up here, yeah, you'll find that's very common up here. I uh, know, that's the reason I can't stand cities. But, um... <laughs> My, my my way my way down here in the south that I was raised is you treat a customer as you want to be treated and you do everything in your power to make them happy but you know at a certain point you know they're just doing it to try to get it for free so you know tell them to go to heck and you know just refuse to serve them I mean at a certain point you have to do yeah go ahead 
<laughs> nah. Oh man, you're down. You live down there. Oh god. Hell. Duh. Oh, I'm sorry. I won't say it because that must be hard at times. Especially now. Ah. Ah. No, you don't. Have you heard the news recently? That I, I mean, I, if you do, if you did know somebody, I'm sorry for your loss. Just throwing that out there. Okay, that's good, but still, it was yeah, still pretty. There's, yeah. There's, there's actually that many people in Vegas, you know, to where it's like trying to play the lottery. Uh, hey, a that's a joke. That's actually, I don't know how to say this, but that's actually kind of a, I almost determined it as a bad joke. <laughs> well. Yeah, that also kind of makes it even kind of. Well, uh, honestly, I, 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 with 100% of my fiber of my being, do not believe that that guy did it. I don't risk wrecking well, because uh, because all the videos and all the visual evidence that was collected points to the twelfth floor was where the flashes were being saw. You know the the gun flashes mm. were coming from the twelfth floor and from another building. And um, uh, he's dead up there on the thirty second floor with a gun positioned beside him and cameras mounted out in the hallway to make it look like he was the one doing it. So apparently so you know he found else? out about it. And, like no, it looks as if thing. he found out what was going to happen. <laughs> yeah, they used him as a what the fall heck? guy. That's what people say, uh -huh. yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, actually, it's almost feel like I'm uh, listening to something about Kennedy at the moment, actually. I think about it. Plus, the one thing that run makes me the one thing that always makes me wonder is where the hell to get all those bullets of that type. That those bullets shouldn't even be on the street. Unless, uh, well, I, I know it's it's uh, uh, it's the popular. I mean, this is popular amongst conspiracy conspiracy theorists, but I actually believe it that the CIA set it up, uh, funded by the Democratic Party, in I order believe to force that. I was stronger gonna, gun control. I was gonna say that. I would believe it. And first thing Hillary said was good control, people. Like no. Yeah, it didn't take it didn't take twenty four hours before they screamed gun control. No. Well, um, actually, every, everybody, uh, I, I, will, I refuse to give up my Second Amendment right, and 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 I've already stated it, and just about 80% of the people I've talked to here in the South say the same thing. If they want our guns, they can take it after they take all the bullets through the barrel coming at them. <laughs> that's how it is in the Midwest. <clears throat> that's the only well. way. That's, well, that's the only way that they're going to take guns out of the South. Mm-hmm. And most of us, most of us... Yeah. Oh no, gun, gun, guns are neutral. People are what's horrible. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. Uh, well, you know why you know why our Second Amendment was put into place that every citizen has the right to bear an arm, right? It it 
it, uh, no, 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 well, that's part of it, but the majority part of it was because of how effective the Armenian men were during the Revolutionary War against you guys, because everybody had a gun, and at a moment's notice, you can just uh, call everybody together and have a militia. That's also why, uh, that's why uh, Hitler did a gun as well. Well, I mean... A mag practice without good. I can rob. I can rob a bank. I can rob a bank with a damn knife. Yeah. Not really. Just stupid people. People that weren't raised properly. Mm-hmm. Or drug lords. Mm-hmm. I heard it's all. I heard it's only like certain people, uh, police over there that's like actually like armed. Is that true? If the citizens, if the citizens don't have guns, then why do the military need it? Well, my theory with that, uh, with that one is because ah, say this, but London has been bombed more times than I've ever seen a city bombed. So I, there, it's. I, I mean, like, Europe, it's, you're, like, pretty much, one of the reasons I think, uh, that, uh, Europe's been targeted more than the U.S. is because, obviously, it's closer to them than the U.S. Well, that much is common sense, but... I mean, so, I mean... I mean... And, like, it's, it's just, like... One thing I, uh, I used to is, I, I'm not saying this is good, but I find it smarter is the fact they're more, uh, at the most casual event possible, they just unleash. They're retarded because they believe that when they die. Yeah, I don't mean just like. They, they, no, 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 no. They believe that when they die, there's going to be 72 virgins waiting on them. But if you actually look in the Quran, the actual legitimate translation of that says 72 olives. Well, I'm just, mm -hmm. I'm just saying, like their ta I'm talking about their tactics, or more. They're retarded. Yeah. They're yeah. True, honest, good tactics is winning without losing a life. Yeah. Russia is definitely not up there with that tactic, I'll tell you that. Well, see, I, I, <laughs> I, I, I mean, I'm a firm, strong believer in why don't we solve wars with sporting events? Three, you know, best three out of five. Right. And it's settled. Originally, you know, that was the Olymp that was what the original Olympics were supposed to be, you know that, right? 
Mm-hmm. Well, our government, our, go ahead. That's actually why I feel sorry the for the most for the Muslims, the, the actual decent ones that have to go through shit because they're dumbasses. I mean, I mean, do you, I, but like, I, right, here's my thing on it. I trust in I trust in the fact there I believe there is a god. I do not trust the people running the thing. I mean, because it's not their that think it's their show when it's not obviously not. You know, that makes sense. Well, well, uh, when I was in college, in my uh, I had a uh, philosophy class I had to take, and the philosophy professor was actually the religious teacher as well, and he sat there and stated out loud to the entire class for everyone to make sure they heard it was that you cannot find a single war throughout the history of man that was not backed by religion mm-hmm mm-hmm or to see he was You didn't get burned out in the middle of the night, I see. Candace has not been on, to my knowledge. Well, happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Oh, I'm back. I'm, uh, I'm a friend of Nahas <laughs> and, uh, and, uh, Spider. Hi. Mazel tov. I always wondered what the fuck that meant, but... I never. Congrats. Ah. Uh huh. It's a. Uh, it's a. Uh, it's. I mean. It's, yeah. Now I know. At first, I thought it was some sort of like drink. At one time. No. It does sound like a drink. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's the best you've got as of right now. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's your favorite? Uh, what's your favorite flavor of tea? Like not flavor, but you know what I mean. Like tight. I like Jasmine a lot. It's my favorite. No, I mean like I've had. I mean like actual, like j legit Jasmine. The flat, like the actual leaves. No, like the actual leaves. Uh, you can tell the difference. Well, you know. And what am I? No, look, I love tea. It's actually. See, listen, believe it or not, I haven't touched a soda in like two years. Okay, there's like, but, but, okay, well, you know what, oh. the fizzy shit. It's coke. It's coke. <laughs> but yeah, okay, like, okay, like, I've had like a Dr. Pepper like once a month, okay, but who hasn't? But like, tea is actually what saved me from drinking so much soda. 
There's still caffeine. Do it. Wait. Orkshire. Yeah. And one of my one of my favorite things ever is a good uh a good uh, uh like berryish tea with a good dark chocolate or something. That is so good. There are these things. Oolong, I was gonna say that. I didn't know if anyone knew about it though. Well uh, uh is that I, I like that smokiness. Or is that the other one? That's the, uh, or is that the, uh, oh man, there was another one that sounds like that name, but it's, it's the one I was thinking of. Uh, Earl Grey ain't bad, it's good for waking you up. Uh, in this, in this country, in my opinion, the best iced tea is Snapple, the same. Yeah, that's not even, that's shit. That's good shit, though. That's what it is, it's shit. I don't Anything care. Else? Hey. <laughs> did you know did you know did you know that about ninety percent of America's honey is not even fucking honey? I know. I mean that pisses me off, man, because honey is like life food. I mean, literally. It is. So is bacon. Honey, real real honey. They I've had wild honey. I mean, before, I, I was sitting there looking at some that a local uh, a local beekeeper made, and I was looking at it as he brought it in. And I was like, "This ain't honey." He's like, "Yeah, it is. I just put it in the jar. I, you cut it with syrup. It's not honey." He didn't die, say that. He you piece out. of shit! Oh my god! What? <sighs> Oh. Ooh. Wait, what? He's going back in time. No, his wife called him. He's going to go I call her. I don't. Talk to her. I don't. But she I'm calls saying. him every day. She calls him every day about 5 o'clock. Man, I'd be kind of. I mean, he is in Cali, so it's 5 o'clock almost. Oh, yeah. Cali, huh? Mm hmm. That. His name is uh, Jacob. Yeah. yeah. On her way home. You know, if I, I actually told myself if I had a boy, it was either gonna be Victor or Jacob. I like Jacob. It's a good name. I like Nathaniel. Like the Drake, like that Nathan Drake. Yeah. No, like Nathan Daniel. Nathaniel. I'm blended. God damn it! <laughs> hey! I liked Uncharted, man. That. <laughs> <laughs> Southern Comfort, huh? Well, that was one of my reasons I like playing with him, because he, he makes me laugh, dude. <laughs> I'm a I'm an opinionated southerner. Who isn't? But yeah, you're Everyone. not a southerner. No, I'm not opinionated. I was about to say that to the opinionated thing. Everybody's opinionated now. <laughs> Shit! That damn I had you, Nazi. <sighs> ah. It. It's funny. It's rare that I find people from the south. It's extremely rare. Yeah. I'm from the south, but uh, everything I've uh, accumulated knowledge-wise is from my own experiences. Right. I, I mean, I sit there and I watch world events unfold and see how people react and, and I mold myself according to how you could be reacting and acting. No matter how many times I've been told to uh, be afraid of bikers and and uh, avoid black folk, and 
I mean, I, I, I've been with people in Birmingham, Alabama, and and they say, lock the doors, lock the doors, these black people will drag you out. Yeah. My mom I mean, and, uh, uh, my mom used to live in D.C. during, like, the 60s and all that. Well, my grandma. She said my grandma, but, you know, I call her mom. Anyway, but when Martha Luther King died, it was, like... He you didn't know. die, he was assassinated. Yeah, I know, but I mean, like, when he was assassinated, it was like... He didn't and the reason, he, the reason he was assassinated is because he started preaching that too far to the south during the time that he was preaching it. Well, this, I feel like it was the south that needed to hear it, so... Well, they did, but they yeah. refused to hear it. You don't understand how southern folk are. Southern yeah. folk are so set in their ways that if you're not agreeing with them, they'd rather shoot you in the face before they hear it. I don't know. What's your opinion on that, uh, Danielle? Because you were born down here in the South. Well, as you know, I'm in Missouri, and that's kind of... It's very somewhat like that, because... Missouri is very... It's, it's a funny one. But it's... I like to say there's two sides of Missouri. There is St. Louis, hey, which hey. is a blue state. Wait, blue city in a red state. And then there is the part beyond, I want to say, around Eureka, where it's like super Baptist. Like, it's not even funny, like Baptist. So we're talking like, if you don't agree with them, it's like, Look, I would drive through there. I would see Hillary hate all every two seconds. Hillary hate. Yeah, just like this big ass billboard, just like big as hell, just saying Hillary for prison, Hillary liary this, Hillary's that, and a Democrat's mm -hmm. this, and it was just like you. You see that down here too. Yeah. But you know you're gonna see that in a Republican state. Yeah. But the thing, problem is, St. Louis is very, I want to say, democratic. Well, I don't like Democrats, but it's like, you're kind of worried about what you're, what's, what's going to happen if you open your mouth, you know. I always like to call this like the, Cal the, Cal the, like, the L.A. of uh, Missouri is what St. Louis is. And it's, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, and also the R. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I was gonna say, Ms. St. Hey, Louis just is chill. very hey, sorry. Hey, hey, that, hey, can you hush for just a minute and let her finish? I'm sorry. Please. I thought she was done. No, she didn't even get it in her mouth. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I've, I've barely been go ahead mm. Mm -hmm. that's why you're not living in Florida I presume Oh, large cities our large cities yeah it, it's I mean mm
That's oh, that's all that matters is that you're happy. Yep. Oh, you actually said it. You actually said happy. You didn't say epi. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> I was there listening real close, waiting for you to say happy again. And I, I was going to nail you on it. Happy. You know. I mean, uh, English people, don't get me wrong. English people have a habit of not using the word H. <laughs> oh, the letter H. The letter H. <laughs> it's whatever makes you happy. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't matter, man. <laughs> It's all fun and games. It's all fun and games to me. I mean, you come into the world hooping and hollering like a fart, and then you die. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. right, well, as soon as your cells start multiplying inside your mother's womb, you're dying. Every time you sneeze, you kill brain cells. Or... That explains me a lot. And brain cells don't reproduce. Uh. Ah. <laughs> you said I got this. <laughs> no. You take two pieces of tissue paper and you twist them and shove them up your nostrils so your nose don't run. And uh, <laughs> and you go stand and look at everybody like, hey, I rub my it. Uh, it's, it's it's fine. It's fine. I'm free. You're welcome. I'm a I'm a I'm offended. I'm offended by the fact you don't know Americans. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that is probably not a joke, actually. Dude. We are. I'm not. <laughs> he said, he's like, I'm a cold hearted motherfucker. I was being sarcastic when I said I was offended. Oh. No, no, people. No, no, no. Americans are most emotional about anything that affects their wallet. Or their pride. Yeah, pride and money. Pride and money are the biggest things that offend most Americans. I mean, they they had rather they had rather say I'm going to sue you than to work it out. Well, and they lose money doing it. Mm-hmm. I got a plan. Let's well, smoke it, it off. Well, that being in debt is actually... Well, the stereotyping that I was brought up in was based off of television. Because back, back when I was little, growing up, all my parents watched on television was biker gangs running around killing people.
Well, you're. Well, see, so you're, you're further along than I am. You really, I mean, you're 34 or five years younger than myself, and you're married, happily, I hope. Hmm. And um, and you know, you have a job. And, you're you know, you're you you're like you got stuff together. I mean. Down, kill us. <laughs> yeah. We don't. Hi. Hey. Hey. I'm excited, folks. Go look at the go look at the uh, the top ten and look where I'm at. Huh. Yep. <laughs> That's a new personal best. It might as well be. I mean, neither of us have been in a biker gang, so we really don't know what you're talking about. So. It, yeah. Pretty much what they do in North. Mm -hmm. If you say or do anything that's not approved by the government, executed. They also, uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, is that proven or is that just hearsay rumor? I still want to put it past them. Well, I mean, I, I know that I know they do not have Facebook or Twitter or anything in North Korea. They have their own uh, private uh, North Korean only versions. 
because they uh, it's, it's simply because he does not want his people having access to what's really going on out here in the world and all the all the arcade all the arcade games at the uh, video game store you know where they go and play video games and stuff is uh is uh designed you know where the kids they're all shooter games and it's all about killing americans Well, it's just because uh, the one that was in charge during the uh, Korean War is still pissed uh, because, you know, we declared the war over, but it was never officially ended, and and there was never a declared victory. So, you know, they're like, the war's still going on. We're still fighting America is the way they see it. Uh, next, next time you get a chance and you're on YouTube, type in uh, "Inside North Korea," recent, recent Inside North Korea, and there is a video that is that was done in early April of this year by a reporter, and uh, he actually got escorted around by the Korean military, so he could only see what they would allow him to see, but uh, he actually got a. Uh, a good idea of what's going on. He actually talked with the people, and they talked about uh, all Americans are bad people. And he's like, "Well, am I a bad person?" They're like, "No, man, you good man, you good man." Well, I'm an American, and they just look shocked. Hmm. Well, 